You're listening to Bark and Wag's 15-Minute Vet Talk. Each week, your host, Polly Requa, interviews veterinarians and individuals in the pet industry from across the nation answering pet questions. Bark and Wag podcast is produced weekly for your enjoyment, and show notes can be found at BarkandWag.com under the podcast tab. That's B-A-R-K-N-W-A-G.com. Please remember to subscribe to Bark and Wag 15-Minute Vet Talk. Thank you for listening to Bark and Wag 15-Minute Vet Talk. Bark and Wag is dedicated to protecting our dogs through advocacy, education, and supporting like-minded dog lovers by selling custom pet products. Bark and Wag is excited to announce our new partnership with a Colorado hemp farm to produce a line of CBD products for your pets. Bark and Wag has CBD pet tincture available in 300, 750, 1200, and 2400 milligrams. Bark and Wag CBD is pet safe, no THC, it's made in the USA, and is CO2 extracted. Please check out Bark and Wag's website, barkinwag.com. That is B A R K, the letter N W A G.com, to see our line of CBD and awesome merchandise. We love pooch ideas for podcasts and merchandise. So anytime, send an email to Polly at barkinwag.com with your suggestions. Welcome to Bark and Wag 15 Minute Vet Talk. I'm your host, Polly Requa. Today we're talking to Cindy Myers, Animal Intuitive, about what is going on in December and January. Welcome, Cindy. Hi, Polly. Good to talk to you. Yeah, thanks for coming on. We love our monthly reports on what webinars you have. And so I wanted to let the listeners know, what do you have going on for December and January? Okay, I have an intuitive listening webinar on the 28th of December. But in January, I've got a couple fun things coming up. Uh, I do have an animal and emotions webinar on January 11th. And then on the 19th, I'm teaching an introduction to animal communication class hosted by Jen Weigel. We've been doing these together now for several months and they sell out quite quickly because we keep the class nice and small. But uh, they're all on Zoom, so it's a lot of fun, and we work with, I start teaching you with your, uh, with my alpacas, and then we, uh, then we include the people's, your dogs and cats, or actually somebody brought their cows, <laughs> sent photos of their cows, and we worked on communicating with their cows. So we get to work with your animals as well as starting off by learning with my alpacas to begin with, and it's just been a real blast. So that is January 19th, and I have i don't want to jinx myself, but we've had 100% success this far, even on Zoom and having people connect and having a special connection with animals intuitively. So it's been a really fun and interesting and a great experience. And so how do people find out about the webinars that you have? My webinars, uh, they can go to my website, yourenergyhealer.com. And I'll also, uh, I'm going to put up the link to the January 19th class. We just got the date set. So I have to double check to make sure it's up on Jen's site because she's the one hosting it. So it goes through her, but I'll make sure there's a link to her page for this specific class on my, my homepage. So. You can go there or you can always email me at cindy at com, or there's a contact page on my homepage as well or at my website and you can reach out to me there and I will get back to you as soon as I can as I'm pretty quick about getting back to folks. So uh, if they have any questions, comments, concerns about their pets. Oh, good. And then I know you are an author. Uh, If anyone's looking for last minute Christmas presents, do you want to tell everyone about the two books? Yeah, I actually have four books. Oh my Uh, gosh. my, My two recent ones are our children's books that I wrote and illustrated myself uh there's one uh the booster booster the rooster who couldn't tell time and then my second uh children's book that was just published is the abcs of animals and emotions and that's a nice little one to help children not only learn their abcs but also uh, get introduced to different emotions as well so for every letter there's uh, an animal and an emotion that starts with that letter and then for adults (laughs) for your reading pleasure i have an animal 
Five Steps to Animal Communication book, uh, which is teaches a little bit more than the introductory class uh, that I've been using, but it introduces the techniques that I teach with. And then I have my memoir, Alpacas Don't Do That. That was my first book. And they're all on Amazon. And actually, there's a book tab on my website too so if you don't remember it just go to my website and go to books and they're all listed there with a link to amazon on any of them that you might be interested in purchasing yeah i know about the i guess i forgot about the two um that you had written before but definitely the uh children's books i actually have purchased those and given them to my niece and nephews oh great i hope they enjoyed it (laughs) yeah yeah so terrific well Any listener that has any uh, questions, please contact Cindy, and I hope you have a nice holiday. Thank you, Polly. You too. Have a very Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and whatever else you may celebrate. Enjoy and be safe. All right. Well, Happy New Year, and uh, I'll be in touch in January to find out what's going on in February and March. All right. Sounds great, Polly. Thank you for listening to Bark and Wag's 15-Minute Vet Talk. If you like what you just heard, we hope you'll pass along our web address, www.barkandwag.com, to your friends and other pet owners. Have a pressing question for a veterinarian? Ask your question at barkandwag.com under the podcast tab. This has been a KFR production. Join us next time for another edition of Bark and Wag's 15-Minute Vet Talk.